Hi guys, I am back with another video. Today's video is actually an update video. So on June 1st, I posted a video about the rice experiment. So before you watch this video, please go and please go watch, please go and check out the first video. It is right here in the description box below. So check that video out before you watch this video, okay? Um, it explains what the rice experiment experiment is what I did so check it out so um today's video is the results okay so it's been about over a month um July August actually July August over two months a little over two months because it's August 13th now and I did this on June 1st this rice experiment um so for those of you who remember, I did the rice experiment, whereas I took three mason jars, labeled it with the date, June 1st, and labeled one mean, labeled the other nice, and labeled the other nothing. So I put them in three separate, room, separate rooms, and to the jar that was nice, I spoke nice things to the jar, to the jar that was mean, I spoke mean things, and then to the jar that said, that had nothing on it, I didn't even acknowledge it and said nothing to that jar. So, um, Basically, I'm just giving you the result of it. Um, so this is my experiment. It's been like a little over two months now. Granted, I talked to the rice jar for about a month. Then after that, I did it kind of on and off. So I did miss days after the month um, of talking to the rice jar. And I'm going to be completely honest with you. It takes so much energy to speak negative words. Okay, I'm going to say it again. It takes so much energy to be negative and speak negative words because I just got so sick and tired every day going to the room and being very nasty and negative to this jar of rice. It took so much energy out of me to be negative and it was much easier to be positive. So let's go ahead and look at it. So my experiment was completely different. Um, I did not get the results like the guy that did it a while ago. Um, and yeah, so I looked at the nice jar this one had no mold in it or nothing. Um, I could see the rice kind of breaking down a little bit, but it had no mold at all. The nothing jar did get one small speck of mold. I don't know if you guys will be able to see it, but it's right there, that that dot. <laughs> it got one speck of mold and it got it's actually kind of very watery compared to the nice jar because this one's very watery and this is the nice jar and this is the nothing jar where i said nothing to this jar and as you can see it's just extremely watery so it broke down a lot faster the uh mean jar actually didn't have any mold in it at all which i found very weird and it was somewhat watery but uh, in between the nice the nice jar and the nothing jar. The nothing jar was completely watery, but this one was like somewhat in between. So yeah, it's really interesting. Like the nothing jar took the, I guess it took the worst effect. Like it felt it the most because I did not acknowledge this rice jar at all. And I could tell it felt it the most. Oh my God, I'm so scared to open it. It's been like a little over two months. Let's just go open it. I'm so scared. I don't because I don't want to I don't want to get hit with no aroma and just be like eh. okay so this is the mean jar I'm gonna open it and smell it oh my god oh my god I just had I, I, I do not want to do this oh, oh ha, ha, ha. okay 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 hold up hold up get it together Dan. get it together okay I'm just so smeared smelt scared to smell it Okay, it smells like somebody hot breath. Woohoo, Jesus. Sorry for saying Jesus name in vain. It smells like somebody hot breath. It smells a little rotten. It does smell a little rotten. But it's not as bad as I thought. But it do smell like somebody's real hot breath. Woo! Let's smell the nothing jar. Oh my God, I do not. My heart is beating because I do not want to smell this. Oh my God. Oh, what? What? Okay. <laughs> sorry, guys. I'm sorry. Okay. Okay. Okay, it smells, it don't smell that bad, actually.
It don't smell as bad. I think that the mean jar smelled worse than the nothing jar, but the nothing jar had a small speck of mold in it. So this is a nice jar. Ooh, did y'all hear that? It sounded like I was opening up some soda, chill. Ooh, what was that? What is that? Whoa, what is that? What is that noise? Ah! The rice jar, the, the nice one don't smell that good. I actually think that, to be honest, I actually think that the mean jar smells the best. I really do, guys. I think that the mean jar smelled the best. What I really took, what I can take away from this exper experiment um, is that it takes much more energy to be negative than to be positive. It really drains you being negative. So, um, life application tip. Try to be positive. When you're going through something bad or when somebody piss you off, I know it's so hard. It's so hard to be positive. Much easier to just be negative and be mean about the situation. But try to be positive and fill your mind up with positive thoughts. Like, don't. as soon as you think about something negative, Nip it in the bud and replace it replace it with uh, something positive. You know what I mean? So sometimes in your mind, the enemy will always try to put negative thoughts in my Oh, you're not going to get that job. You're not going to do this. Nip that in the bud and be like, yes, I am. Yes, I am. I got this job. It's mine. It's mine. This is for me. You know what I mean? Because like I said, negative, negative thought, negative, negativity is so draining, than, so much more draining than positive, positivity. So I don't want to talk your ears off, guys. I hope you really enjoyed this video. Let me know your thoughts. Let me know if you are going to try the experiment or if you did. And I look forward to seeing you guys next time. I love you guys. Thank you for your support. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. And share. See you guys. Bye.